Hi friends, it's the 1st of August, Independence Month. I wish you a safe, COVID-free, monkey-free month. It's almost been three years since COVID and no signs of dying down. Two good things have happened because of COVID. One, we've all been aware, become aware of Big Pharma and the medical mafia. And two, people are more amenable to change. I myself don't wear a mask and don't even test. And I've been encouraged in this by my good friend and classmate from IMA, Dinesh Gopalan. He's a prolific poet and a personal finance guru of the highest caliber. This is his poem, COVID. This is how it goes. Take a flu, give it a name, call it COVID or R2D2. It will spread and it will morph since man evolved. Flus existed. Take something normal, spread the fear. Co-op the media and WHO. Falsify data to increase deaths. This with comorbidities as of COVID-2. Create a vaccine full of poisons. Like any allopathic dark drug, the remedy is worse than the disease. Falsify the data of vaccine deaths. They are, of course, due to comorbidities. Promote the vaccine as an elixir. If you read the ingredients, you will not sleep. Spread the fiction that can be prevented by masking and social distancing. In spite of all the evidence, people will still believe those who masked and distances are still getting it. Those who took the jab are getting it too. And while they're getting it bad, which they will never admit. Meanwhile, there are those in the slums and bazaars who didn't mask or distance and got more immune, not just to COVID, but to other viruses too. And to every variant that it morphs into. Those who didn't take the vax are luckier still. They are even more immune. But they are few, for the system ensured through jobs and travel that they took the jab since they were compelled to. Humans are strange beings. They have all the evidence in front of their eyes to see all this, but they will not see and continue to pretend that vaccines are good and masking too. For we are locked to admit that we've been taken for a ride. Our ego won't permit to admit that we've been had. Meanwhile, the WHO and the powers that be have introduced another pandemic. Now it's monkeypox that makes the news while COVID, COVID variants rule the roost. People in search of magic pills line up for the next vaccine while being told that they must mask still. All the masking is sapping their breath, breathing through a clot is going through hell. They breathe in through a cloth filled with their own exhaust, a germ-filled abomination that they think is good. They breathe very shallow, which spoils their health again. For deep breathing is the basis of health. They spoil their immunity further and further and are ripe for the picking by the pharma mafias. Welcome to the new world. Panic stricken is the new brave, running hither and thither, not knowing what to do. COVID by Dinesh Gopalan. Think about it, friends.